In this segment today, we are going to look at writing a number in five different ways using the HTO chart. When a student is asked to write a number in a different way, um, we would first draw our chart. H stands for hundreds, T will be for the tens, and O is for the ones. Um, given an example of a number like 436, the students would write the 4 in the hundreds, a 3 in the tens, and a 6 in the ones, and that would be our standard form of writing, and I'll abbreviate it. The next way a student would be asked would be in the picture form. And to model this number in a picture form, we would use blocks. The hundreds look like big squares. So since there are four of them, we will have four hundreds. Our tens are represented in rods, which are like sticks. So there goes three tens. And our ones are tiny little cubes, which students can draw it as little squares or just dots. One, two, three, four, five, six. The third way of writing a number would be in base 10 words. What students would do here would be to look at the picture and basically write out what they see. There are three hundreds. I'm sorry, there are four hundreds. Three tens. And six ones. The next way would be seen in an expanded form. And in the expanded form, we're just using numbers to represent it in the place value. So we would have 400 plus 3 tenths would mean 30 plus 6. And finally, the last way is just in word format, spelled out. So 400 30 6. And that would be writing a number in five different ways.